Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nathan Williams with BlackRain79.com and today I wanna to talk about how to make $50 a day playing poker. Now, as many of you guys know, I started out playing in small stakes games just like you guys many years ago and I was able to, through a lot of trial and error, able to quit my job eventually, travel the world, ultimately make a full-time living from this game. I then went on to write several books about poker and overall, uh, this game's been very good to me. However, I know that a lot of you guys that are watching in this video or just starting out in the game or perhaps you're having trouble turning a consistent profit so i really want to talk about in this video if i were to go back and start all over again today how i would go about making around 50 dollars a day what kind of games i would play in what strategy the mindset all that kind of stuff now i do just want to point out that making money consistently in poker is a certain number is not really the way the game works because poker is going to be is all about the ups and downs some days you win some days you lose some days you're break even so really i'm talking about making about 50 dollars a day on average i'm not saying that you're going to make that every single day i just want everyone to be clear about that that poker is a lot like investing you're going to have days where you make a lot of money and you're going to have days where you lose money and some days around break even but the whole goal is to have more winning days than losing days all right so tip number one to make 50 dollars a day is to play in fishy poker games now this is extremely important because you guys need to understand that all your money in poker comes from bad players players who play significantly worse than you all right so how do you find the bad players well well number one you can just just use a poker tracking program like poker tracker uh, there'll be links to that in the description below if you want to get it and this will just allow you to put some numbers on your screen if you play online poker that just tells you who the fish are you want to look for players that are playing 40 percent or more of their hands that's vpip in poker tracker now if you're not using a hud you can also look for all the common signs of bad players which is limping too much playing a lot of bad hands playing out of position chasing every draw calling down with ace high and all sorts of nonsense you guys know what i'm talking about these are the guys you have to have in your game if you want to make a, a long-term consistent profit each day and especially if you want to make around 50 dollars a day this is where most of your profits going to come from so you need to make sure that there's one of these players at your table at all times so tip number two in order to make around 50 dollars a day playing poker is to play a tag style and this is something i talked about many times before tags by the way stands for tight and aggressive and really what I mean by this is being highly selective with the hands you play pre-flop, being highly aware of your position at the table, playing most of your hands in the late position seats, especially the button and the cutoff, and also applying a lot of pressure after the flop, even when you don't have a good hand a lot of the time. So those are kind of the big three for a tag. Now in a short video like this, I really can't go into a whole lot of specifics and that's why I've written a free poker cheat sheet that covers every single aspect of how to play a proper tag style. That'll be the top link in the description below. All right, so tip number three in order to make $50 a day playing poker is to multi-table. Now, of course, if you're playing live poker, this isn't really going to be an option for you, but I think a lot of people watching this video play online poker, and the beauty of online poker, of course, is you can play multiple tables at once. This is going to allow you to multiply your earnings. So I would highly suggest learning how to play multiple tables at once. I know it's a little bit intimidating to a lot of people at first, but once you really learn, for instance, the tag style that I teach in my free poker cheat sheet, once you get that sort of memorized and internalized, you know, a lot of your actions at the poker table are just going to be automatic and that's going to allow you, that's going to create a lot more downtime because you, you don't have to think so much and that's going to allow you to add more tables. Just always add one at a time. If you're just starting out on one table, just go up to two tables and then try three tables after that if you're comfortable with two. But uh, this is ultimately going to allow you to multiply your earnings significantly and make a lot more money in poker. All right, so tip number four in order to make $50 a day in poker is to play at least 1,000 hands a day. Now, this is really only gonna be possible if you are multi-tabling online poker. And the reason I suggest playing at least 1,000 hands a day is because you ideally want to be playing at fairly low stakes because that's where a lot of the bad players are going to be. So especially if you're a beginner, you're starting out, it's also gonna help you tremendously in finding more bad players because most low stakes games have the majority of, of the bad players in them and once you increase your volume up to around a thousand hands as a minimum each uh, as a minimum I would say each day 
This is really going to allow you to get to the long run a lot faster in poker, get over those bumps in the road as I talked about before, the up and down days. And it's just going to allow you to maximize your win rate over time. All right, so my final tip to make $50 a day playing poker, and this is probably the most important one on the entire list, is to quit if you are feeling tilted. Guys, one of the biggest reasons why people do not win at poker, as I actually talked about in last week's video, which I'll link right here, the biggest reason is tilt. You know, if we want to make $50 a day, for instance, consistently in poker, one of the biggest keys to making this a reality is to not get frustrated and start playing poorly when things don't go your way. As I talked about at the top, that poker is a game where you're going to have winning days, losing days, break even days. Some days, though, you're just going to get bad beats all day, coolers all day, and there's nothing you can do to win. So those are the days when we need to be able to cut our losses, to not sit in there and keep throwing away money like most people do because you know they get all frustrated and they wanna win it all back and everything. As somebody who takes this game seriously, which I'm assuming you are because you're watching this video, this is not gonna be an option for you. So it is really, really important that you do not sit in there on bad days when there's nothing you can do to win. You have to have an off switch on those days. Something that I'd suggest a lot is using a stop loss. Maybe it's if you play cash games, maybe it's three buy-ins, maybe it's five buy-ins. Depends sort of, you're gonna to have to gauge where you're at mentally where you know, what amount of losses kind of set you off. If you play tournaments, you know, maybe that's, you know, three buy-ins, five buy-ins as well. But you're gonna to have to figure out what that amount is where if you lose a certain amount, it starts to affect your play. You just have to have sort of a rock solid rule that once you lose that amount, that you're out of there for the day because you know that your mental state is going to start going downhill and you're going to start playing poorly. So if you want to make consistent money in poker, I would highly suggest focusing on your mental game. All right, so just to recap everything, if you wanna make a consistent profit in poker averaging around $50 a day. You definitely need to play in fishy games, play a tag style multi-table, play around a thousand hands a day. Obviously more is gonna be better. That's why we're gonna be multi-tabling of course. And most importantly guys, you can't be in there playing when you're tilted. You have to have an off switch. You have to be able to leave the table on those days. So anyways, I hope a few of these tips were helpful for you guys. You know, like I said at the top, poker's not really a game. It's not like, a, you know, you get a regular paycheck where you just like, they write you $50 a day. It just doesn't work that way, unfortunately. But you know, if you're playing in low stakes games and using the tips on this list, like I said, if you can keep your mental game specifically in check so that you're not losing your mind on those bad days, uh, it's definitely possible for somebody who's serious about the game, who has a good work ethic, who's gonna get in there each day to make roughly around $50 on average per day. So if you guys enjoy watching small stakes videos like this, make sure you're subscribed to the channel here because I got tons more poker strategy videos coming your way soon. Uh, and also give this video a like if you found it helpful. Lastly though, I wanna know what you guys think, so make sure you leave me a comment below. Do you make $50 a day playing poker? And if so, uh, what kind of strategy do you use? Let me know your thoughts on that in the comments below. So so thanks a lot for watching guys. I will see you next week. This has been Nathan Williams with BlackGrain79.com.